I thought I'd give you a quick haul. It's cancelled. Yeah, I've just cut my hair. Got this white cropper. Back from Aldi. We've done our facial times. What I thought of the seven husbands of Evelyn Hugo. Good morning. Happy Saturday. I have just been doing my skincare and brushed my teeth and I've just straightened my hair. I've just put it up in a clip because I want to do my makeup. Um, I feel like my skin has really improved recently through like the recent skin care I've been using. I have just filmed an evening routine yesterday and that should be up for this so that will have all my skincare phase but I feel like since I've been using them on the constant I've definitely noticed the difference. Like I said it's Saturday morning and it's actually walked out to town. I've been just kind of been chilling in bed and watching some YouTube and obviously I've been straightening my hair. So I've just been letting my skincare set and I'm actually going to do my makeup today. I feel like I haven't done it in ages so I'll do like a little time lapse of doing my makeup. Um, today is we're going holiday shopping so in the evening vlog I would have uh, mentioned we're going to Mallorca in two weeks and I'm so so excited but I just want some new bits like I do have a lot of holiday bits but now you just want something like new to take with you so you know, some like new sandals or dresses or play seats or whatever so we'll go and see what's mainly in the car market because I'm on a little budget at the moment I've had some car issues again so I don't really know what's going on with that. But I thought I'd get a couple of bits, see what there is, and plan out to see, I'll bring you along and show you. Um, I don't really know what the plans are for the rest of the day, I just want to do a little bit of holiday shopping. And you can want some new bits as well. But I'm going to go ahead and get ready and come back to the I've just got changed. I feel like those clips I looked really orange. I think I had the wrong camera setting on, but is what it is. So I've done my makeup. I just used the um collection feel to finish. I just didn't really want like foundation on. I've just put on this white crop from Zara. I've got a grey blazer on from I don't actually know what this is from. And I've got my grey Zara leggings on. I'm gonna wear my new balance 530s. I'll show you a proper fit when we're leaving. Um so I'm just chilling out, so hopefully we'll go soon, but I'm all ready, so I'm just going to probably just do some touch-ups. Um, I'm probably going to take my Prada bags, but like that will go best with this outfit, and then we can do some holiday shopping. I've been looking on like the Primark website. I want to look at like their sandals and some of their like dresses and jumpsuits. Um, yeah, hopefully we'll find a couple of cute bits. Um, obviously, I will bring you along, but I feel like my makeup's okay. I haven't straightened my hair in ages like, properly, so really enjoying that I feel like it has grown quite a lot as well which is really nice um yeah I'm just watching some YouTube and I will get back to you when we're in the car this is my outfit for the day it's like a white crop from Zara this grey blazer I don't actually know where this is from some grey Zara leggings and I'm going to put on my 530s I've got my Prada bag um it's not like really warm but obviously we're going shopping in a shopping centre and they're always so hot in there so I thought it should be fine 
I'm so excited to see what there's going to be. I'm just looking for like sandals, some beach stuff. I'm excited. Okay, so we're literally just arriving in the town centre. Um, it's actually, the sun's actually come out. I mean, I still don't think it's going to be like hot, but I mean, at least the sun's coming out. It's not raining, um, so it's good vibes. Like I said, we're literally just going to Primark and maybe H&M, but that's, I don't really know what else. It's probably about it. Just have a quick look around the town and see what there is. But hopefully we find some nice cute bits for holiday because that will be really, really nice. Um, I'm just glad the sun's come out. So it means good vibes. We're in Primark. We're in the Primark fitting rooms. Tom, if you hear me talking, I'm on my camera. Um, I've just picked up a bunch of holiday stuff, a lot of dresses, some trousers. Um, so I'll try things on and show you as we go. This is the first thing. I'm trying on this cute little orangey yellow summer dress. This is the first thing. I don't know if it's a bit see-through, but it's quite cute. I just don't know if I love it. I'll ask Tom, it's cute. It's a little bit see-through. This is the next one, it's super cute, little green number, I like this little hole. Super cute summary, so I might keep this. I'm liking them so far. And we've got this one, this will be sent us for a day, day, or like an evening dinner. It's so cute and long. Love the pattern. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to return anything. The next things are, a skirt, a pair of shorts and a pair of trousers, so let's see. Right, then we have this skirt. I don't know about this, I'll have to ask Tom what he thinks. It's like a long skirt with a little slit. It's super cute, super flattering. Could be cute with like a nice top or like a bikini top. Let's see what you think. Then we've got these little shorts, I don't know about these. I don't know about how they fit. I'm not sure, I feel like I'm more like a dress person, so I don't know if I'll get these or not. See what Tom says. And then we have these little beach trousers. I think I like these. I think these are quite cute to throw on over a bikini or for like an evening out. I think they're super cute. Let me try the sandals on too. So these are the sandals. I think they're just going to be cute for like the daytime. Just showing you my toes. Okay, so we're in Cove I don't really think you can hear me, but I got a boneless banquet. I've never had one before. So, you know, it's just chip popcorn chicken, some boneless chicken, barbecue sauce, I've got on the side and some gravy. And I got a watermelon and lime refresher, it's really good. And I bought all of those things apart from the shorts, so. So, we're back in the car, it's now half three. Obviously, it was so busy, wasn't it? We went to Primark. We went to Primark and we basically bought everything we picked up. I'll show you what Tom got when we get back. I'm but still annoyed about that. Yeah, we basically went around the shop, went and paid. And then on the way back, Tom found some really nice stuff that he hadn't seen. But So I just bought that for him. Um, so you basically saw everything that I got. I just didn't get the shorts. We just got a shake away. I got Kinder and Biscoff and Tom got Kinder and Nutella. It's really enjoying that. It's kind of giving us a tummy ache. We got a KFC. I had a bonus banquet and Tom had a... Zinger burger, something like that, and it was really nice. Um, and now we're heading home. It's actually quite. Um, it started raining for a bit. I went into the bookshops to look for this book, and it's just never there. That's a duck. Um, a duck. What do you mean? A duck in the car park. I do have a duck. What a real duck? Yeah. Where? Over there. Oh, but we're gonna head home, and then we'll probably go on a little walk later on. Okay, it's so sunny. Um, we're just at the garage where my mini is. This lighting is not okay. Um, because I, obviously, where I was driving to work the other day, I left my lunch and my drink in there. So Tom was just coming to pick up my stuff from it because the guy is going to come and fix the car at some point. Um, so we need to get everything out of it, basically. Oh, I don't know if there's stuff in the boot. So we're now at like a place basically where we left the red mini oh he's here is that the RIC man it's an RIC man coming to sort this red car that won't start so i'm home tom is sorting out the red mini because obviously it's getting towed back to this guy's house and i just can't bother. i've got so much to do i want to have a shower i want to shave my legs um and I need to try my mum's holiday stuff and I need to edit a video so I thought I'd give you a quick haul of what we ended up getting obviously you basically know everything I got so I thought I'd show you Tom's stuff because we found some really nice stuff for men like in the Primark section so there was like these purple drawstring shorts they're such a thick material and this was like Kem from Love Island's like collection 
and it came with this really nice purple top so I thought that was really cute holiday vibes he got some like green uh, swimming trunks I think bright colours are always great for summer and um, just got some cosy white ones because these are just great for in England as well which is lounging about in the summer these were really cool they had like loads of pattern shorts and these were so cute they're like this blue kind of print um and they were only 14 pounds really thick and a nice knit material that you wear for summer um is that all he got i think so and then i got these sandals which i thought were so cute so you saw these like in the little clips in the changing room i got these sandals these were only seven pounds super cute for like the daytime um and i got the what? oh tom got some white swimming trunks too so I got the beach trousers um, and I got the green dress which I thought was super cute because I want like a nice colourful feed for like holiday and summer. Hold on, Tom's calling me. Hello? Yeah. Love you. Hold on. Got send Tom a postcode, and this was my favorite. This dress is so gorgeous, I think it's gonna be so nice for the day. So, I'm gonna also for like an evening meal on holiday. So, it's like this pink and green dress with like a little bow, super long and midi. Again, you saw all these on the trial clips. I got the pink skirt and the yellow dress, and then we popped into boots to look at some like tan and oils and stuff. We haven't picked any up yet, we're gonna do that next weekend because I think what we're gonna do is go on some tan in beds tomorrow and then we're going to go two next week and maybe one just before holiday to kind of get that base holiday tan and then I just picked up a new Eshard razor I used to have one of these but I don't actually know where it's gone so I thought I'll just pick myself up a new one it was on sale and I think it was £7.95 and I got sent one ages ago and I loved it yeah I just can't find it recently so I saw this and it was on sale so I thought I'll just pick up a new one and it comes with two razor heads and the shower attachment and I got it in this really cute like little purple colour so I thought I could use that for some freshly shaved legs um so I think what I'm going to do is go ahead and take my makeup off and do my shower first I think because I can obviously edit a bit later as well so I think I'm going to have a nice shower oh the water be hot enough actually what might be cold? I'm going to turn it on and see what it's like and if it's cold then I'll do a bit of editing first but let's go and see we're not really hungry because obviously we had those I also used to try my mum's clothes so I'll show you anything that I try on after my shower um yeah we're not really hungry because we had those shakes so I don't really know what we're gonna have for dinner um, obviously I'll let you know. Um, tomorrow's plans though, I think we're going to pop to a car boot sale which is a bit further away. I think it starts at half seven because it was so big last time. So we thought we'd have a little look at what they've got. Just something from, we haven't gone for a while until I actually mentioned it so we thought why not. So I think we're going to go there. I need to deliver a vintage parcel tomorrow. Um, and what was the other thing we said? I don't even remember. We said something else. Um, I might go on like a run because I want to go to the gym but obviously I don't have a car but then apparently this guy's given me a car for the week so then I can go to the gym in the week because I really just want to go before we go on holiday but yeah I'm going to go ahead and take my makeup off and then hopefully the water will be hot enough to have a shower <laughs> Okay, so I've had a shower, I've shaved my legs, they feel so smooth but I just love an estrogen razor like if you haven't tried one I definitely recommend they're just so nice on the skin like they don't cut your skin or anything and I literally love it I just put it on with some conditioner and then put some shower cream on afterwards to make them nice and soft I've just got all my clips this weekend vlog isn't very long that I need to edit as you can see so I'm just going to quickly go ahead and edit this and then if Tom's still not back I might read a bit of my book um but yeah let's just get this done and then that's ready for tomorrow so it's actually like nine o'clock we've just been chilling out um and we've come downstairs because tom said there's a boxing match on or something who's even fighting Ryan so we're gonna watch that we still haven't eaten because like i said we weren't that hungry because we had um kfc and a shake away but we're just gonna order like one large dominoes and get two half and half two sides, I don't want a side though yeah, like i'm happy like with just a pizza um, so we're just going to get a Domino's because it's just quick and easy and then we've said we're going to have no takeaways until holiday because we really need to like be good. So it's quarter to ten, we 
ended up ordering a pizza express because Domino's apparently stopped doing their half and half, which was ridiculous. Um, so what did you get for your half? Pepperoni? Margarita? Hello? Yeah. Margarita or pepperoni? I got barbecue burnt ends. Oh, really? So Tom got barbecue burnt ends and I got like a mushroom, like my half, and then we got halloumi bites and ovals. Or something. Um, but it's still not here. It says it's a like it took forever to assign a driver, but I still don't know what's going on. So we're just still waiting for it. But I've been sat here editing the vlog for last weekend. So that's all edited and ready to go up tomorrow. It's not too long. It's only half an hour. Um, but we're gonna pop Grey's Anatomy on now. Um, and just chill and watch that. But yeah, it's quarter to ten, so it's getting quite late. So hopefully, the pizza does arrive soon. Um. I also got some PR today, so I will show you when I go upstairs, but yeah. Okay, so our food has come. We've got, like I said, half and half. So I've got like mushrooms and Tom's got a, have you even got pepperoni? No. Have you got margarita? Barbecue burnt ends. Oh yeah, barbecue burnt ends. And then, what else did we get? I think these are like halloumi bites or something. Yeah, they're like really cute little bites and then what else did we get? Dobles. Mm -hmm. So we got some dobles. Why are they really small? <laughs> they're normally that small. <laughs> and we're watching Grey's Anatomy, so life is good. So we're heading to bed. Tom nearly um, locked us out of our room. I have a lock in my room for many reasons. Um, and he left his key in the room and locked the door. So he's just had to pick the lock. I don't know how he's managed to do that. <laughs> <laughs> he's managed well, to pick the lock. Tweezers and a screwdriver. Tweezers and a screwdriver. Oh my! Call me. I just dropped that. Call me fucking. What is it called? Maguire or whatever. It is. So can you? I've just dropped that towel. Um. But yeah, we're gonna head to bed. I will show MacGyver. you. The, Tom, I'm trying to talk. MacGyver, um. I'll show you the PR that I got today tomorrow in the morning. So it's like nearly midnight. So we need to go to bed. I'm just gonna read a bit of my book. Um. And then in the morning. We are getting up super early, so we're going to a car boot sale that starts at half seven. So we're going to go there. Um, I need to come home then and shoot, shoot, uh, get ready, shoot some content. We need to do a food shop. Um, I need to post a video and I'll show you the PR haul. And I need to do some washing. So we've got a lot to do tomorrow, so I will see you in the morning. Good morning, happy Sunday. We're just about to leave for the car boot sale. It's 10 to 8. We are leaving a bit later than we wanted to. This is the fit. I don't know if I'm going to be warm enough. I've got this white top on from Urban Bless, it's slightly long sleeved. These joggers are from Drehoas, I think. No, after chat. And this cardigan is from Urban Bless. I just threw on my pink trainers because I don't want my new balances to get ruined, but we're going to go, so I'll speak to you in the car. Okay, so it's a bit easier to talk to you now because we were in a bit of a rush. It's just before 8 o'clock and we're on our way to the car boot. And it's quite a big one, it's like just over half an hour away. Um, so we're going to pop there just to see what's about. We haven't been to one in a while. And, you know, sometimes there's like really good stands. I remember last time, do you remember when I got those like night jumpers? And they were like vintage, vintage, vintage night jumpers and they were like £5. Oh, was it two for £5? I think, wasn't it? It was either two for five pound or five pound each, but like either way, it was really good. You go down. Yeah. Um, it was a really good deal. So we're just gonna go and see. She's a learner. Don't don't. She's a learner. Um. So yeah, we're on our way there, and we're gonna go to the car boot sale. See, we won't be there too long because, like, Tom knows what he's looking for, and I'm not really looking for anything. It's just I literally just like looking at some of the stands for certain things like books or like like I said the vintage jumpers and stuff I can't I don't know if I'll be bothered to look through like the rails and stuff I bet you can tell the vibe when you look at the stand um so we're going to do that and then because it's still quite early we're going to go straight to Aldi afterwards and do our food shop so that we know that we've got our food for the week um we'll obviously need to get like lunch stuff and breakfast so that we know how much we've spent um and then after that we're going to come home I'm going to do my makeup I've got my outfits ready for content and this is actually one of them um, so then we can shoot some content only up the road. So I've got content for the week and then that's kind of it. We might get some bed later, or we might just go to the sun bed tomorrow, not tomorrow, in the week and on the weekend. So we'll see. It's nine o'clock, ten past nine, excuse the mess. Um, and we are back home. We got to the car boot and it was cancelled. I mean, I don't know why we didn't look to see but I think it's because when we woke up it was sunny but apparently because the floor was 
but the ground's wet, they've cancelled it. So we've come back, I've just uploaded my video and that's all ready to go, so I'm just going to make the thumbnail for that um, in a minute. Um, but I'm just going to do my makeup, I'm going to go shoot some content and then go to Aldi. I've got four outfits, this is one of them that I've got on. Um, I've got like a little blazer moment. I've got like blazer and jeans and I've got a like trousers and a top. So I'm going to do those today. Then we're going to pop to Aldi and do a food shop. Obviously I've got four meals already and then hopefully we can come up with some more while we're there. On my way though, I did finish The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo. This book is amazing. I 100% recommend. Gave it five stars. Honestly, couldn't put it down pretty much the whole time like unless I've been really tired. And I just finished it and like the plot twist... Okay, I wasn't expecting that. I didn't realise the reason behind her choosing the girl um, to interview her or anything, but really, really good. Definitely recommend. So I'll be moving on to something else later. So I'm having a look, and I don't really know what I'm feeling. I might read The Love Hypothesis, because I've had that for a while, and I've wanted to read it for a while, so I might move on to that, because I reckon I can finish that before I go away. But I'm going to go ahead and get ready, and I'll come back to you, and I'm looking a bit more presentable. Okay, so we've arrived at a content location. I've got my first outfit on. I've just got what I had on earlier, so this white top. Joggers, cardigan, and I've got my 530s on. I've got some sunglasses. I've hit my hair in like this little burn. And we're going to go shoot. It is raining, which is not ideal, but we're right in front of like a car park, so we're going to do it in there. Okay, so we've got the second fit on. I've got a plait in my hair at the back, like a really loose one. I've got a grey blazer on, white crop, blue jeans, 530s. Got a little Costa cup and a black bag as props, and um, we're gonna go shoot again. Okay, so the last fit, I've just plaited my hair, got this white crop on, I've definitely just got foundation on it, but we can edit that out. These trousers from Pull and Bear and 530s again, so we'll shoot this one and then we're gonna go to Aldi. I've just thrown a jump from, we've shot three outfits, obviously we need to go to Aldi, it's 10 to 11. So yeah, I shot some really cute things, we've got like this little fit with like, the cardigan and the joggers and then we I did a video for each one as well and I've got this fit which was with like the little plait and then we just shot these ones so we've got some really cute little picks so I'm really happy with those so I've got some content ready we've got a cute little pick too that one's quite cute Tom that my squishy ear um, so yeah, we need to go to Aldi, we also need to eat, but I don't really know what we're in the mood for. Um, yeah, I'm just glad i got some content now because I haven't done any in a while, so I was in need to have a content day. So, well, so I'm glad I've got all that done, basically. Life is good. Okay, we're back from Aldi, we've done our food shop, I think it was £36 for four dinners, lunches a week, fruit a week, breakfast a week. So I'll show you what we got. I got some cornflakes, it's such a big pack and it's only six crew pit. So I got that for breakfast and Tom got like the fake version of Crave, so craze. We got some halloumi pitters and cucumber. Have you got the cucumber out? No. I'll find it. Um We've got halloumi pitters and cucumber for lunch with sweet chili sauce. We've got a tiger bloomer for lunch, that's the bread we've got. We've got a whole pack of potatoes for two of our dinners. We've got the lentil sweet chili crisps. We've got these light chocolate pots, which are really nice, really like those. We've got some blueberries, we've got sausages for sausage straight bake. Um, Carrots for a sausage tray made as well. We've got some more apples as a snack. Hold well, on, look how many apples there are. There's just so many apples. <laughs> Summer. They're not all my apples, by the way. They'd bought some of them. We've got brioche buns for burgers. Some bolognese sauce. We found this like red thyme spied salmon to have salmon pasta and then we've got some pork mince for beef and pork mince for um beef and pork. Yes, beef and pork, did you realise? No, I didn't be fine. For bolognese and for the burgers. Um that's all that guy. We've got pasta and spaghetti. Raspberries. And 10 cents. 
for the salmon that I'm saying as well. We've got some ham, uh, some jives, which are really good snacks, and some cheese for our sandwiches. So that's everything, so I'm going to go ahead and put it away in our fridge, and then Tom is picking up lunch. So, put most of the food away, just got to put this stuff away, because basically I have like this box that I put my stuff in, and it's a bit messy so i need to sort that out but we've made our little pitters they look really yum so we're gonna go ahead and eat this and then finish cleaning up so i've taken my makeup off and i'm in the middle of kind of like sorting out my room it's got a bit messy as per usual but you know that's just life um so i'm sorting that out a bit i've got a bit of youtube on and i'm just kind of picking everything off the floor i just put a wash on so my basket washing glass is like behind there and it's not over piling anymore it's like normal i mean it is still full so i need to do another one tomorrow but i thought i've obviously taken my makeup off i tried on some of my mum's holiday clothes they don't really fit me there's a couple of things that are okay um but probably not but i thought i'd quickly show you the pr hacks i don't think i showed you yesterday so i don't know if i've showed this already in another vlog i got sent the tan Lux express mousse um and this looks really interesting so it says like if you put it on and after 30 minutes it'll be a tan or you can leave it obviously longer to get it darker so i thought obviously now i can tan i could try that out next time i pick tan so that's quite exciting and yesterday I got a package from Sisley Paris um, and this is like a bunch of their makeup to try so obviously I'm not going to do my makeup now until next weekend but we can try that out together. Um, so we've got a foundation and it's a really cute packaging as well so we've got this foundation so we'll see what the colours like. It looks like it will match me when I'm tanned and then we've got a liquid eyeshadow which is like this really cute like goldy pink colour which looks really pretty and fun to try um, then we've got the matching concealer which is in like um, a little tube and it came with like a little concealer brush which I think is so cute um, we've got a little lipstick which is a really pretty colour it's like this gorgeous like pinky colour which is like my go to colour anyway so I thought that's perfect and then we've got a mascara. Oh, oh, yeah. Then we've got a mascara as well. So we've got a lot of new makeup bits to try. So we can try these out next weekend. So I'm quite excited about that. But that's all I've got this weekend. I don't think there was anything else new. So I'm excited to try those out. But yeah, like I said, I'm just at the moment sort of my room out and then we're going to go on a walk. It's actually only like half two so because we got up so early i feel like the day is just we've had so much more time in the day which has been really really nice so yeah oh and i can't remember if i said did i say let me go check my purpose. i did summarize what i thought of the seven husbands of evelyn hugo it was so good the next book on my agenda is the love hypotheses i think i'll read that next before we go on a holiday and then i've got to decide what holiday reads i want to take yeah we keep sorry about tom's video um we keep checking the weather because it's so up and down like the week coming in mallorca is like 28 29 30 and then it's like it keeps saying that when we're going it's going to only be like 18 i mean obviously we're still going to be grateful to go away but we're hoping we're going to have some hotter days so fingers crossed that happens we're just keeping an eye on it every single day and hoping for the hot weather so my room is pretty much clean there's a couple of things left on the floor and i just that part up there is like underwear and also loads of socks that i need to try and find the matching pair because i feel like it's just my washing machine that eats my socks because it's literally the most annoying thing in the world um it's 20 past three i'm just going to recover my eyelashes i've just sorted my makeup drawers as well so they're all tidy um, i'm just trying to decide what to do for holiday because obviously we said about a sunbed but i know they're not like the best thing for you and i'm also thinking like is it even going to give me like a good tan after like two or three do you know what i mean so i'm like do i just fake tan before i go and then obviously as it comes off i'll be tanned underneath I don't know. I don't really know what to do. So I'm just having to think about that. I've got time. So 
It's okay, but we're just about to leave to go on a nice little walk. My mum's making a roast dinner for dinner. We've got roast gammon, and I think she's bought a cheesecake as well. She likes to do that on a Sunday. So that'll be really nice. I've changed what I'm wearing. I don't know if I said. I've got a Blakely jumper on and just some green, like, leggings from Topshop, I think, from ages ago. Um, so I'm just watching some YouTube for 10 more minutes and then we're going to leave because Tom's just watching a football game. I needed to wash my hair really, but I can't really be bothered. So I'll either wash it tonight or I'll just wash it tomorrow. See what I feel. So obviously we've got Grey's Anatomy on in the background because obviously we're still trying to binge that. Um, I'm just throwing my hair half up, half down so I can do my evening skincare. Obviously, you're just going to use all, use all the usual products. I keep forgetting I've got that Estee Lauder night repair in the car, so I need to take that out because I still haven't tried it out. And obviously, it's meant to be really, really good. So I'm going to try and remember to get that out tomorrow. So it must be in your car now, um, Tom. So I'm going to get that out and try that tomorrow. But for tonight, I'm just going to use like my usual skincare. I'm just going to put my Apple Watch on charge. Obviously, we're going on a holiday, not the Friday coming, but the Friday after. So going to the gym. Well, I can't tomorrow because I don't have a car. So I'm going to go on a morning like run walk situation. Um, so at least I've done something. And then I'll go back to the gym on Tuesday once I've got a car. Um... But yeah, it's 10 to 9. We had our roast dinner. We also had like a little cheesecake and a chocolate cake or something. Um, I posted on Instagram. I posted like a little get ready with me. So I've just kind of been watching that. I've been watching some YouTube, watching some like travel vlogs. I'm really enjoying like watching those at the moment. Um, and I gave Tom two books to choose. What did you choose? Um, oh, he'll have to choose in a minute. I gave him The Love Hypotheses and The Fine Print. Because they had two that are on my list to read. So I said, if you just look at them and read the back and tell me what one you think. So he's going to be the judge of the next book and read him before we go away. And obviously, like I said, I want to take two holiday reads. So I need to have a look at which one's like holiday-y. Um, but I'm probably going to end the vlog because I'm not reading anything else. Like I said, I'm just going to do my skincare. And then we're literally going to be sat in bed watching Grey's Anatomy for the rest of the evening. And I'll probably read a bit of whichever book he chooses. Um... But I mean, I hope you enjoyed the vlog. I, don't, I feel like we didn't get up to too much, but I feel like we I do have some exciting things like coming up. Also, next weekend's going to be quite busy because it's the weekend before we go away. So it's just going to kind of make sure we've like got everything for holiday, like getting sun cream and all that. And I think we're going to have a little London day out because, like I said, I've got loads of food places I need to visit. Um, so we can have like a little foodie day and go and get some food and do some trying, and I can let you know my opinion on some places um and then obviously monday's a bank holiday so that's just going to kind of be just make sure we've got all the finishing touches for holiday probably like packing our stuff ready because we're going to go to tom's on the thursday of that week um because we're driving from his house to landing to gatwick because it's closer and then we'll be going to mallorca so we're going to have a london vlog and a mallorca vlog next like for the next weekend vlog so that'll be really really exciting um but i hope you enjoyed the vlog anyway and hopefully the next one will be more exciting um but if you like me you like my content then please subscribe and i will see you next time